Hi, I'm Linda from Skin Company. What are the effects of overcharging and overdischarging lithium batteries? Let's first talk about what overcharging is and how it affects battery performances. Overcharging refers to continuing to charge a battery even after it has been fully charged. By design, where the negative electrode has a higher capacity than the positive electrode, any gases produced at the positive electrode can recombine with the cadmium compounds generated at the negative electrode via the separator. Consequently, in typical circumstances, the battery's internal pressure does not increase significantly. However, if the charging current is too high or the charging time is too long, the generated oxygen cannot be consumed fast enough. This can lead to increased internal pressure, battery deformation, leaks and other adverse effects. At the same time, its electrical performance will also decrease. So what is overdischarge and how does it impact battery performance? When a battery is discharged beyond its stored electrical capacity and the voltage drops to a certain level, Continuing to discharge, it results in over-discharging. The cutoff voltage is typically determined based on the discharge current. For 0.2C to 2C discharges, 1.0 volt or cell is commonly um, set as the cutoff. While for 3C or higher discharges, such as 5C or 10C, 0.8 volt or cell may be used. Battery over-discharging can have a disastrous consequences especially for high current over discharging or repeated over discharging, which affects the battery even more. In broad terms, over discharging results in an elevation of the battery's internal pressure and causes irreversible harm to the active materials of both the positive and negative electrodes. As a result, even recharging the battery can only partially restore its capacity and this recovered capacity will degrade um, significantly. I'm Linda and I'll be sharing more lithium battery knowledge daily, so remember to follow.